am your father. Philip Wesley, the mile high mouth. Ah, pff, whatever. That's that's terrible. I'm sorry. Okay. Hey, ah. Uh, you still here? Good. Anyways, I'm your host, Philip Wesley. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome back to Area DMG. I'm your host, Philip Wesley, the Mile High Mouth. And if you may have figured from my terrible attempt to do a um, Darth Vader impression, we're going to go ahead and unbox Darth Vader. This is a vinyl blocks Funko thingy, vinyl with attitude, Star Wars um, thing. They're from 2012. Um, this is number 23. There's Boba Fett. There's a Star Trooper. I think we'll go ahead and, uh, it's not Star Trooper, a uh, Storm Trooper. Star Trooper. Star Killer. Uh, whatever. Anyways, there's Boba Fett. There's a Storm Trooper. Not an order, whatever one. And, uh, Darth Vader. And, um, at some point we'll probably unbox this one. And, uh, yeah. Woo! But let's unbox this one. This is, um, the side of the packaging. The bottom of the packaging. The side of the packaging, it's number 23. Um, like, yeah. And there's the back. It's a bobblehead. And let's go ahead and unseal this thing. Let's release it into the wild. Anyways, uh, let me talk a little bit about Star Wars while I'm doing this. Um, there's a new Star Wars thing out there. We wanted to see if people would actually uh, like or watch these particular kind of videos and I thought well let's see let's go ahead and uh, we'll pull him out Woo. Oh, whole insert thing came out too interesting let him rise from his uh, prison Whoop. okay come on oh what was that oh um, a thing Ah, why it's so difficult. Ah, there we go. Whoa. Whoa there, Darth Vader. Got a, a little thing, which I think holds this in place. I don't know. Wait, no, it goes on there. It's a little face mask thing for his face mask inside the packaging. He's like, Rise from your city, Gotham. Or something like that. Anywho, it's a bobblehead. Yay. He just sits there and grooves on your desk, or you can nail him to your dashboard, stick him to your dashboard. He has a uh, little red lightsaber, some buttons, the most detailed backing I have ever seen. Oh my gosh, look at all that juice. I mean, uh, look at all that detail. Woohoo! Yeah. Ah, he bobbles. He bobbles and stares at you, compelling you to go to the dark side. If you have someone who has a desk, or drives a truck, or something, and wants to put this on their dashboard, I guess it's better than a, uh, a hula hooping or hula dancing whatever. Anyways, this is a pop figurine. It doesn't really do anything but sit there and look, uh, most impressive. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all you can do with those. They just sit there and they're, and they're there. <laughs> I'm kind of in the new movies. Yeah, that's, uh, this is a uh, Star Wars pop figurine. Whoa, he is really top-heavy. Hold on. Uh, whoa. He is. He doesn't really stay put. Ah, if you have him on your desk, you're going to want to... You're gonna want to tie him down. He's kind of not a good figurine. He doesn't want to stay put. He just wants to fall over. And, and that's kind of a shame. But yeah, this is the um, Funko Vinyl Blocks Vinyl with Attitude um, Darth Vader. Yeah, from 2012. You're gonna need to tie him down or tape him down to whatever surface you put on. Otherwise, he'll bobble himself right on over. Hmm, if I had a desk, yeah, he'd be kind of cool, but I would have to get some of those little cell phone sticky pad things that they sell and put that on my desk and put him on it so he wouldn't fall over. But yeah, whew, that's that. So, um, if you like us unboxing and commenting a bit about pop figurines or Funko pop figurines or whatever, 
um, go ahead and hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. If there's stuff you want us to talk about or unbox, tell us in the comments below. Um, I'm your host, Will Wesley, the Mile High Mouth, and until the next video comes out, you are now caught up.